In the quaint town of Stratford-upon-Avon, as the curtain of life began to close, William Shakespeare, the illustrious playwright whose words had captivated the world, faced his final act. The man who had penned tragedies and comedies alike now starred in his own, not on the stage, but in the confines of his home. The air was thick with anticipation, as if the muses themselves hovered, awaiting one last verse from the bard's lips. Yet, Shakespeare's final moments were shrouded in silence, a departure devoid of the eloquent soliloquies that had defined his work. What thoughts crossed his mind as he lay there? Did he contemplate the characters he had brought to life, the stories he had told, or the legacy he would leave behind? The world would never know, for his last words were not recorded, leaving us to wonder what parting wisdom he might have shared. The twist? Shakespeare, the master of words, left the stage of life without a final monologue, his death as enigmatic as some of his plays. In the end, it was not his words that echoed through time, but the profound silence of a life's work complete, a reminder that some stories are finished not with a flourish, but with a quiet bow.